followed by One Life to Live and General Hospital, right here on SoapNet. Hey, 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 hey. Valerie, what? Hey, Jamal. What, what are you doing here? Why are you following me? She's in respiratory arrest. You gotta do something. You gotta save her. Colleen, we're gonna have to tube her. I need one milligram of epi, 50 milligrams of diphenhydramine. Got it. Don't you go anywhere. Are right, you stay with me? Breathe. Breathe. Yeah. Lucy, Alice, what's, what's going on? Oh, uh... Eve, look at you. You should be back in bed. You no, know, no, come no. On. I was I looking for Ian. I came up here to look for him, and I heard all the commotion. Oh, my God. Is that... yeah, it's, it's Libby. What? What happened? Let's get, come here. Calm down. Get, let me tell you. What happened? Libby, Libby was bitten. <gasps> no, it's by a snake. Eve, a snake. Kevin and Ian have the snake. They're working on the antivenom. So please, don't worry. Everything's going to be fine. No. Just... Don't say it, Lucy. Don't you dare say everything is going to be fine. You, of all people, should be able to see it. See what? This means that Caleb is back. He is back, and he is coming after every one of us. What happened? She stopped breathing. You're not going here. You stay with me. You hear me? Yes. All right, a little too crowded in here. Could somebody please get out? Look, now. I'm not going anywhere. Neither Chris. am I. Oh, she's breathing. She's breathing. Gonna be okay. It's not okay just yet. She still has that venom inside her. Olivia. Find me. Come to me. Okay, Mommy's I told here. you he's fine. Look oh, at him, he's beautifully he's fine. Baby. Oh, oh, my mommy's here. Oh, I told you. Oh, I, I was so just scared. Hi, <laughs> baby. But he's okay. He really, Caleb is gone. Oh, Everything's gonna be fine. Here. How do we know that? Are we really sure? Well, hey, nothing's for sure, you know, but listen, I am a vampire slayer, so I would think if Caleb was around, you know, I would be sensitive if he was undead. It's okay. It's okay. Really, I'd sense it. Yeah. Yeah, I guess you're right. Yeah, okay. Okay. Okay, baby. Okay. Well, good but boy. <laughs> good boy. That's my Daniel. That's my Daniel. Oh, I he doesn't want to go back. Heart. Oh. Where did that come from? I assumed it was yours. No. Well, maybe someone left you a surprise gift, huh? Donna, where did this mobile come from? Uh, it was there when I came on. I assumed you and Ian put it up. No, we didn't. Can you please find out where this came from? Uh, sure. I'll ask around. Thank you. Hey, it's a um, mobile. It's a soft, kind of cuddly little mobile. Look at it. It's cute. It's harmless. There's no sharp edges or anything. It's great. Watch. There. Who would just send a gift and not say anything? Who? 
BP's dropping further. The fluids are wide open. What the hell is he in with that antidote? Listen to me. You have to hang in there, all right? You have to hang in there. Libby. Olivia. 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 Marry me. Olivia, my sweet. I'm gonna give you everything you ever dreamed. Olivia, please. You are the light. Come on. I won't. Livy. Let you down, kid. Livy. I promise. Finally, good. Let's do it. Ah! Ian, what's going on? I don't know. It must be a reaction to the antidote. No, this cannot be happening. Vivi. Jack. It's all right. Your vitals are returning to normal. Oh, thank God. Do you know who you are? Cheech. What town are you at? It's working. Order some blood tests just to make sure. I'll get a room. Thank you. Both of you. All right. Let me find that snake. Hey. Dad. You gave us quite a worry there. I'm sorry. No, 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 no. It's okay. You're gonna be fine. I'm gonna leave you alone with Jack here for a while and go tell Lucy what happened. Let her know you're okay. I think, I think she's with Eve. <clears throat> okay, thank you. Allison? Hi. Thanks for coming. Of course, where else would I be? My best friend. snake at the catacombs. Yeah. Olivia, I know you went there. I found your bracelet. You gotta tell me why. Hey, Gabby, it's, uh, Allison. Um, can you tell me what time Jamal left the retreat? Because I've been trying to track him down and I can... What do you mean you think he's still there? Yeah, no, um, if his car's out there, I'm sure that he's... Yeah, um, thank you. Okay, Valerie, answer me. What are you doing here, and why were you following me? I wasn't following you. I was hiding from you. Okay, why would you want to do that? I'm your friend, remember? The guy that helped you get away from Cedric? Help deliver your baby? Speaking of which, where is, where is Hope? She's fine. All right, what's going on? What's, what's this all about? I can't tell you, Jamal. You'll hate me. Valley, I, I can never hate you. OK, so come on, just talk to me. I don't have the baby anymore, Jamal. I lost her. But at least, at least Livy's okay, thank goodness, huh? Yeah. Yeah. Thank goodness. Well, it's a miracle Jack found that snake. Yeah. Now, but you're right. Yeah, you know, it's, it's just that, um... You're not thinking... Well, I mean, with all this stuff that's been going on lately... Caleb had nothing to do with this. Young Livy was bit by a snake in the park. Okay. A snake that was found in the catacombs. Caleb's catacombs. So what do you think? He came back as a snake? He's capable of anything. We all know that wait, by wait, now. Wait, 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 wait. Calm down, because Jack killed the snake. The snake is dead. It is. Eve, I'm so sorry. I forgot to give you the note. It's from wh whoever sent the mobile? Yeah, I found it when I came on duty. to a very special baby from a very special friend. 
It's him. It has to be. Eve, no. Yes, Ian. You know that Michael used to call our baby a very special baby, and Caleb would know that because he and Michael are the same person. It's Caleb. Please. He's back, and he's come to take our baby like Eve, he said will, he would. Will you stop doing this to yourself, no, please? No, you don't understand. No, you don't understand. Caleb's gone. It's over. I don't think he's dead. Ian, I can feel it. He is dead. All that's left is a pile of ashes. Eve, Ian's right. You're just giving Caleb power by not letting go of the fear. You won't be able to let go of Caleb until you let go of the fear. Caleb's gone. Livy's okay. You're okay. Uh, yeah. You wow. You must all think I'm crazy. I think that it's, uh... Probably just the pregnancy hormones, you know? I'm just, they're driving me a little bit of nuts. I, I'm sorry. Right. I'm sorry. Okay. I'm just sorry. Fine. We we just want you to be happy and enjoy this incredible kid. Oh, I want that too. I really do. All right. So what do you say I take you back to your room so you can get some rest? But I want to spend... Colleen will take care of the baby. Eve, I'll take really good care of him, I promise. Oh, sure. I'm, I'm sure you will. All right. Let's go. Come on. Okay, um, just let me uh, let me uh, say goodbye to little Daniel first, just for a second. Okay. Right. Okay. Come on, check on Levy. I'll be back. I'll come with you. Eve. I know. I'll try and stop worrying. Okay. okay. Lucy. Um, I'll catch up with you in just a second. Okay. Okay. Colleen, can you give me a minute, please? Of course. Uh, take all the time you need. Thanks. Uh, Lucy, you can go, too. It's all right now. Everything's fine. Psycho Eve has left the building. <laughs> I don't think you're psycho at all. It's not over for you, is it? Not for you. Not yet. Lucy, what would you do if your very famous instincts were screaming at you that something is not right here? just did. I would pretend to listen to every single thing that Ian said and everything Kevin said, and then I'd forget it and do exactly what I felt I needed to do. Ian just doesn't understand. I know. But I do. I do. I know you don't want to be here, but they need to keep an eye on you for a while. I'm fine. You have to tell me why you went to the catacombs. The snake was in the park. Uh, but you were in the catacombs some time before you went to the park. And why? Caleb's ring. Oh, Libby, come on, please don't start about the ring. It was there, Jack, in the music box. What music box? The music box in the catacombs. But I was in the catacombs and I didn't see a music box or a ring. Just like I didn't see a ring in my room. But Jack, I saw it. You didn't. Your mind's playing tricks on you. I mean, mine's been doing it too. I thought I felt that power, that strength, but it was gone. And I realized that I probably was never there to begin with. I swear to you, I saw it. Libby, you should be sleeping. How are you feeling? I'm fine. And I'm not tired. I really, I really just want to talk to Jack. Well, you can talk later. You need to rest right now. No, you know, they're right. But I'll be here when you wake up, okay? Well, maybe we can get you out of here and take you home. No more talk about Caleb, all right? You have to get him out of your mind. I love you. I love you. We'll see you in a bit. Good night, sweetheart. Good night. Good night.
Jamal, I tried so hard to be a good mom, but it was tough, you know, real tough. And then I lost my aunt, and Hope got sick. I. Well, the baby's sick now. She's okay now, but at first she had problems. I was so scared, being all alone with no one to help me. All the while terrified that Cedric would find us. Oh, yeah, I hear that. The baby got sick. I didn't have any money. And here was this little helpless child who depended on me. And I couldn't give her what she needed. So I. I gave her up. You put her up for adoption? They're really good people. So. How'd you end up here at this place? I came because of your letter. What? What letter? I received an anonymous note telling me all about this place. It was postmarked Port Charles, so I just assumed. So I didn't send you any letter. Oh. Whoever it was, I'm grateful to them. I know what you're thinking. I let you down after everything you did to no, help me. No, you didn't let me down. hard it must have been for you because I know how much you loved Hope. I still love her so much that I tried to get her back but it was too late. Look I'm sorry I really I just I wish I could have been there to help you out. No matter what you say the truth is I screwed up and now Hope's gone. My baby girl is gone and I'll never get her back. Shh. Get back to her room. Uh, yeah, yeah. I, I think she's okay. And um, what? Uh, Libby, really? Is she okay? Well, physically she's fine, but I think we've underestimated the toll this whole Caleb thing has taken on everyone, especially Eve and Libby. Maybe there's a lot more to it than that, Doc. What? Well, think. Just think about what's going on. This snake bites Libby. A snake from halfway across the world somehow ends up in Port Charles. How is that possible? And then it almost bites Allison. And now. At the same time, even Ian got this mobile, this gift from some mystery person. Unsigned card, but it did say, to a special child. Doc, that's how Caleb, that's how he referred to Wait a minute, the... Lucy, you're not suggesting that I don't Caleb... know, I don't know. I don't know what I'm suggesting. I just know that this whole thing is not some post-traumatic thingy, whatever you call it. But I thought you, you told Eve that... I know. I just didn't want to worry her. She looked so sad. But I feel something. I really sense something evil is is around, and I guess that's what maybe Livy was feeling in the catacombs, and, and maybe that's what's got Eve all in a dither is this evil thing. And Doc, I was just thinking that maybe. Wait, I'd... wait, 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 wait. Don't think. It's just, just for tonight. But please, this is. Please, please. I, I just need a break. That's all. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I'm sorry. I know. Listen, um, I, I just. I need to do one thing, just a, a small errand. I'll meet you back at the lighthouse, okay? Okay. Just hurry, all right? Okay. I love you. Too. Okay, don't worry. It's gonna be over soon. It is. Okay. It's just not over yet. Not yet. Jack, hey. Come on in. This is a surprise. I, uh, just wanted to say thanks for what you did for Libby. Jack, just forget about it, okay? I was just doing my job. Glad everything worked out. Well, maybe we can grab a beer sometime. Sure. Why not? I'll see you. Okay. I'll see you. <laughs> Wednesday, September 12th. Managed the snag a sample of Livy's blood post vampire. Can now compare it to the sample I took from Gabriella during her infamous Mistress of the Dark Reign. This will bring me one step closer to busting the code. And of course, a well deserved place in history. It's not my imagination. You are real. Livy, what are you doing here? Where's Daniel? Caleb. Stay tuned for.
for scenes from the next Poor Charles. Tempted. What did you forget? Of course I didn't forget. Forget what? Caleb has the baby. What? He's here. Caleb stole the baby. In Pine Valley, it's all about Erica Kane and her world. On SoapNet, it's all about you. Coming up next is All My Children on SoapNet, devoted to soaps and you. Up next, it's All My Children, followed by One Life to Live and General Hospital. Right here on SoapNet. Tune, Poor Charles.